hey guys in this tutorial i'm going to teach how we can create a scroll button which will take you directly to top when you scroll down go down and when you click directly on this you'll be reaching to the top Once you're logging into a dashboard, hover over plugin and there you type add new and then the search option you type WP front FRONT scroll and there you get WP front scroll top and it's have 40,000 access download with 5 plus rating. Click on install now, click on activate and now scroll down and there you find WP front scroll top. Click on setting. First you enable this, scroll down and there you click save changes and now visit your website scroll down and uh, something is not working so we will go back and, and now there on the top it's written if you have a catching plugin clear the catchy for the new setting to take effect so we should hover over catching and plug all catchy and if you are using uh, any catchy plugin go and delete from there because so many people they are using w3 cachy or some other cachy plugins and next once you are done scroll down and click save change now visit the website click uh, visits website new tab and now scroll down and there you see beautiful scrolling button and when you click on that you will be redirecting directly to the top scroll down and again click it's moving smoothly and now go back to setting option and there you see java script asynchronize increase the site performance keep it enable if there is no conflict in case if there is something is not working just remove this javascript effect is 200 pixel when you move 200 pixel down this effect will come or else it will disappear let's move 200 pixel and this effect comes when you increase the height like 1500 after scrolling 1500 pixel that button will come and next scroll down and size of the button how much size of that button you want and next is the button size you can set to 00 for all of it in case if you want to have bigger size you just add the pixel opacity at how much opacity you want on that button 80% is enough for me and next button fade duration to after 200 uh, millisecond that button will fade and scroll duration is 400 millisecond that when you click on here it within 400 millisecond it has to reach on the top and next is a auto hide when you click on that auto hide that this text will this button will uh, uh, disappear after two seconds when you are not using that like i didn't click so this has to disappear within two seconds got disappear and let's hide on a small device when you're using a mobile device this button should not come and next is small device size let's click on this and it say this is a mobile size 640 pixel and when it reaches the mobile size that button will disappear and next hide on wp admin when the admin is logging that button will disappear hide on iframe the button will hidden on iframe usually inside pop-up when the pop-up is there that button will disappear and next what you want on that button in case this is the image we are using if you want you can use text like click on text and type the text anything take me to top and you can set the color background color as you like it's have color white and background color is black so white and black and next in case if you want to add some custom css you can add custom css from this location and let's click save change we have made this back check me back to text and clear the catchy in case if you're using catchy plugin and let's refresh this and take me to top and next go back and there you click on the image option and select the image let's i'll go for this image and choose a page where you don't want to display or uh, all pages i want to display on the all pages and include in the following pages home pages checkout pages etc etc pages these are all the pages that i have created in my website you'll get all page option you select the pages on which you want to display that beautiful button so i'll go for all pages and i'll choose the image 
and in case if you have any custom image the choose this option and just put the link and click on save setting and go and refresh it and now you can see this beautiful button came up